Hi, my name is Mark, and we're going to look at how to market a food product. It depends what type of food product we're talking about. If you're a food manufacturing organisation and you have a brand name, then of course things are structured a little bit more clearly, other than if you're a small entrepreneur introducing a food product, product to the market. The big question, of course, is how are you going to distribute this product? Is it a fresh product or is it a packaged product? Is it a frozen product? What type of product is it and how do you see it being sold? Are you going to sell it to small little retail shops or food outlets or to supermarkets? How is this going to be moved? This is the question. But really, more importantly, when you think about the marketing element of it, you need to think about the basic aspects of what the food product is, who the target market or the segment market is, how it's going to get distributed. Have you done some, most importantly, market research about this type of product prior to even contemplating anything else? Who is this product aimed at? Who is the segment? Who is the target audience? And how do you see them consuming it? What's its attractive features? What's its attributes? What makes it an attractive type of product? Where is it meant to be at? Is it meant to be ate there and then? Does it have to be eaten there and then, or does it, can it be stored? What's its appeal? What's its interest? Where, again, is it going to be consumed? Think about this. Once you have this, then research has been conducted, then you obviously have to think about how it's going to be distributed. And then, of course, the pricing aspect of it. Is it competitively priced? Is it a premium product? Is it going to be only found at delicatessens or something like this? What, what is the pricing strategy going to be? And then, of course, how are you going to promote this, really promote this? Is it a product that's going to have national distribution, therefore you need to promote it on a broadcast medium? Or is it going to be a word-of-mouth thing? Is it something that's so special that once somebody gets it in their hands, they're going to spread the word? Okay, you need to think about all of these things before starting. One final element when we talk about promotion with food uh, marketing that you might want to consider is the packaging. This is the real marketing element, the, the tangibility marketing element. This is what makes it appealing. The colours, the size, the shape, the potential, uh, the image, the promise of what is, being, uh, what is inside the packaging. This is your real tool. And again, depending on what, which channels you're selling it to, you can make this very, very appealing. So you need to think carefully about the, the design and the packaging element. 